Hi, I'm Andrew. Today I would like to teach you how to find the molar mass of tin 2 oxide. It's fairly simple, actually. I have a nice little process to help us out. Watch. Bam. So the first step of the process is to write down the elements in the compound. So we've got tin and we got oxygen. Next is then to identify the number of atoms, and that's where the subscripts come into play. So there's one tin and one oxygen. Then we're simply going to multiply those values of the atoms by the masses of each element, and those masses are found on the periodic table. So tin is 118.71, oxygen is 16. So let's write that on in. 118.71, oxygen was 16. Then we're going to find the total mass of each element here by simply multiplying this row and across. So the math here is very simple, right? For tin, it's the same as its mass on the table, and oxygen, same deal. Then to find the total mass of the entire compound, all you literally got to do is simply add this column on up. So that's going to be 134.71. And the units there are grams per mole. That's because we're finding molar mass. Now you know how to find the molar mass of tin 2 oxide. Thank you very much for watching. If you can help us out, tell some of your classmates. That'd be awesome. All right? We really appreciate it. Take care.